graduation event ng bagong upong PMA Superintendent Vice Admiral Leonardo Calderon Jr., iniiwan niya sa masiglahi class ang mensaheng ito. I hope they will not get easily frustrated. So that would be a, a real challenge to them. Uh, handling and leading real soldiers. Be steadfast also in your role as protector of the people and uh, adherence to the Constitution. Sa araw ng kanilang commencement exercises, walang iba kundi ang Commander-in-Chief na si Pangulo Arroyo ang panauhing pandangal. Sa kanyang keynote speech, sinabi ng Pangulo na gagamitin niya ang mga bagong tapos sa PMA at ang mga mahuhusay na tauhan ng sandatahang lakas para ipatupad ang isa sa mga programa ng kanyang 10-point agenda, ang proseso ng kapayapaan. As new officers, you are expected to be a unifying force to bring together your fellow soldiers and the civilian communities where you will serve in endeavors that will win battles but also further peace and development. Ito rin ang naging pagkakataon ng Pangulo para manawagan na magtipid sa panahon ngayon ng global financial crisis. I have issued an executive order to all government agencies and this should include the Department of Defense, the Armed Forces of the Philippines, and the Philippine Military Academy to reduce their respective maintenance, overhead, and operating expense budgets by 1.5%. Government-wide, this will translate into a savings of 7 billion pesos. Isang daan at dalawamputlimang milyong piso rin ang ipinalaan ni Pangulo Arroyo para sa mga disabled soldiers at sa pamilya ng mga kawal na nasawi sa larangan ng labanan. Ito'y housing assistance na nagkakahalaga ng 180,000 pesos kada pamilya. Be proud that you are among the few who have been molded especially to make a difference in our people's lives as you rule your own life with courage, loyalty, and integrity. Congratulations and make good. Bukod pa sa telebisyon ay maaari nyo ring mapanood ang The Working President sa rtvm.gov.ph. Join me again next week at the same time dito sa ating programa. Ako po si Jolina Magdangal na nagpapaalala ng Weekend Beat the Odds. Magandang araw po sa inyong lahat.